Welcome! You're looking at the character creation screen for Guild Wars 2. In this beta, only Char, Human, and Norn are available, but all of the professions are playable, which is pretty cool. Uh, hopefully, this little video will help subside your curiosity on the differences between racial and professional character customization options. I will be uploading more combinations, but this video will focus on a Char Engineer, and I'm really just making this video so that you can see the differences between them. So I'm not really going to spend a whole lot of time uh, to showing you the different faces or the different hairstyles. It's really just to show you the differences between, say, a Char or a human. So uh, let's dive right into it. I'm going to pick Char, uh, and I'm going to make my Engineer be a male, uh, an Engineer. Pretty sick looking already. Okay. So, uh, again, I'm not going to go through too much, but you can do your different body types, your fur, uh, these are your hairstyle options, your face and your horns, and actually I would probably stick with these horns anyway because I think that they are sick. Um, face details, what's really cool about this is that you can really change um, how your face looks, but I think that it's just the right amount. You know, when you play things like Skyrim and games like that where you can customize it almost too much, uh, you spend hours and then you look but you take a step back and you're like oh my god it looks stupid or his head's too small or something uh, but I think this is just enough and it's really interesting that you can change the color of your gear uh, just another level that they've added now we get into the storyline customization which is such a really cool aspect I'm glad that they in integrated this it really pulls you into the storyline better my most useful tool is my universal multi-tool pack. It's got a wrench, it's got a screwdriver, it's got a spade, it's got a lateral displacer. It doesn't matter what you need. This pack has a gadget for every situation. I'm not really sure what a lateral displacer is, but I can guarantee when this video is over, I'm going to look it up. Uh, eagle eye goggles. Nothing sees the world more clearly than a soaring eagle. These goggles allow his wearer to see as well. I'm assuming something like that might be hinting towards stealth but you can't really tell you have no idea what the gameplay is going to be like or how much this is actually going to, to integrate um and the last one panscopic monocle the details matter whether you're double checking the wiring on your new explosives or changing the gear shaft on your favorite turret this monocle lets you see what needs to be seen I'm not really sure what that means uh i'm assuming that there's something that has to do with i i can't even really take a good guess this page, uh, it, I'm pretty sure, spans all characters and uh, all professions. Uh, trouble may follow me, but I use my charm, dignity, or ferocity to overcome it. And I really think that those are pretty self-explanatory. Not going to read them. Uh, I am proud to be a Blood Legion soldier, an Ash Legion soldier, or an Iron Legion soldier. Blood Legion pretty much uh, charges straight into battle. Uh, ha hands on, head on type of guy. Ash Legion, uh, cunning. They use more planning, uh, that type of stuff. There's words in there I can't pronounce. I don't know, so I'm gonna skip reading it. Uh, and then the Iron Legion. Uh, they rely on machines and guns and cannons, metalwork, and they're all perfected. And most importantly, guns. Now this one I'm pretty sure is a char specific. Um, I think like the human has like a god where you pick a god or whatever you'll see it in, in that video if you choose to watch it but uh, basically it's asking you to pick a partner and the partners kind of go warrior, uh, elementalist, thief. Uh, <laughs> Dinky here is our guardian which I think is so ironic and I love ironic uh, name titling in games like this and then Reva is another uh, engineer. Very cool. They tell me, and I think this is also another char, uh, specialized screen. They tell me the soldier that sired me is a loyal soldier, sorcerer shaman, or honorless gladium. Um, not really sure what those are hinting at. Um, I, I would have to say it has something to do with your storyline, but I can't be any more specific than that, so you already knew that. And then all you have to do is uh, sign your name, make your character. I've been in and uh, already seen what kind of names we work up with. So, um, pwn your noobs. Uh, I'll be playing with you, pwn your noobs. <laughs> Whoever that, that guy. Okay, I'm going to end the video.